I mean, I think having been at a tons of fests, I mean, I think what really separates Tallgrass is just... Maybe that was a better answer. <laughs> I, I, I'm what I call a true believer. I actually believe this shit. Mind if I look at my notes? I think I, I feel like I'm spacing now. I'm like, oh, whew. <laughs> So I had not been to Tallgrass before last night to answer your question. <laughs> You want me to spell the whole thing? Sure, it's T A L L G R A S S. And 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 let me repeat that: the Tallgrass Film Festival is one of the best things about Wichita and the entire state of Kansas. And here's why. You know, you can write about tall grass and all the excitement leading up to it. But until you go, you don't really uh, realize just how cool of an event it is. Tallgrass is a huge film festival. It, to just be here says a lot about Wichita, says a lot about the community. First time I filmed a screen of Tallgrass, uh, the audiences here were pretty amazing and, and so engaged. For me as a filmmaker, the best film festivals were small regional events in which the community was highly active and really involved in it. You know, last night there was almost, you know, five, six hundred people at that theater, probably more. That's, that's huge. You know, I go to Cannes, I go to Toronto, I go to Sundance, whatever, and I'm always singing the praises of Tallgrass to people that have never been here. They go, because before I became here, I would have had no clue. I would have no idea. And I can't tell you how many times and how often when festival discussions come about, how much Wichita comes up as, a, as an incredible sort of city, culturally. To me, art and culture really affects um, how I see the city. I'm in music, I, I'm in a band. They're always like, oh, there's not a scene. We want to go somewhere else. So I think it really affects whether people stay or go. You know, when you grow up here, you kind of take things like tall grass for granted almost. But now, you know, I'm realizing that, you know, if we want things like this to continue, that we need to support them. We were making up our, our calendar the other night and we were like, well, we can't see that movie because it's at the same time as the afternoon party. <laughs> That's our priorities too. <laughs> we kind of treated it as a vacation, so we kind of saw Wichita through tourist eyes and that was pretty special. So it was just kind of neat to be downtown and walking around from one place to the other, becoming kind of part of what's going on and, and enjoying it that way. I have to admit, I thought, okay, it's a city in the middle of nowhere, and it'll be interesting. Uh, I had no, no idea. I mean, far, far exceeded my expectations. You know, I, I think the first time I came out here was three years ago. I'm still blown away by uh, Midwestern kindness. Yesterday, I lost my coat at a party, and I mentioned to someone, and then like 20 minutes later, my coat showed up. When you support Tallgrass, you're supporting everything about the city. You know, its creative endeavors, even its business endeavors. It may be kind of stunning to hear someone say, I've never been to Tallgrass. And there are a lot of people who haven't been. And I go through this all, so many times where people go, is that okay for me to attend? You have like red carpets and stuff, and am I allowed to go? And I go, that's why we're doing this. We're doing this so you can go see movies. Yes, we want you to come. If they were to just come out, you know, and check it out for a day or two, their whole perspective of Wichita really can change. An event like a film festival, like a Tallgrass Film Festival, every year it offers Wichita a chance to put its best forward all over again. I was contacted um, through one of DC's sister cities called Sunderland, England. It's in the northeast of England, about 20 minutes south of Newcastle. It's a town that was pretty much decimated in the 80s. It was a huge shipbuilding town, a huge coal mining town. There's a downtown core where the, the train and the buses all come to, and there's a mall. But then outside of that mall, there's all these empty shops, and it, it's really sad. 
And so a few years ago, they asked me to come in and help them create a short film festival. I guess it's like the first time I came, which I was told it's kind of, uh, and I found it really charming. One of the questions on the survey is where in Sutherland would you like to see this festival? And we listed all these venues, and then we had a write-in question, and most people wrote in that they wanted to see films in Newcastle, the big town that was over that has all this cultural uh, amenities. When we actually created the festival about eight months later, uh, it was all in downtown Sutherland. It was in a bunch of different locations. Sometimes they were bars, sometimes at the back of theaters. They just finished their second festival. They're getting ready for their third. They're, they're committed to making this happen. They're, um, the city's investing a lot of money in arts and culture. Even a small investment by a city into a, a small cultural event that has visionary leaders that really can see where it's going after a few years. I, that's, a, that's an incredible investment. They're like the small motors that sort of kickstart the bigger machine to get it going. You know, when you go to a city, why, what, what about the city is attractive to people to want to live there? If people perceive Wichita as being an arts and culture center, then they're going to want to come back. When that energy of the creative elements and, and the social elements of a city really start to bloom, it's a big draw for a lot of people. I feel like there would be a hole in, in Wichita and in the scene if Tallgrass wasn't here. Every year I come back, I'm just, wow. I mean, it just continues to get bigger. And, and that's your feel-good answer. On the real tough economic sense, it also brings dollars and business into the community. And so I think supporting Tallgrass is really supporting Wichita. If you, if you support innovation of filmmakers and you support creativity, you're really rewarding the values that made Wichita, Wichita in the first place. The Tallgrass Film Festival is one of the best things about Wichita, and here's why. Tallgrass makes Wichita a better place to live in that it brings culture. They're, they're connectors. They, they connect different people in the community who have different skill sets together. It was just a really social experience, and I guess I wasn't quite expecting that. That human connection, which is so needed right now, it's, it's a beautiful thing. And to see the city rallying behind uh, this festival each year. That's kind of what Tallgrass is about. And that's why tall grass matters. Is that enough? Oh, you need me to say that again? <laughs>